بصة واحدة طيب مش مهم دوز ار ذا مان ار ذا مان اوف ار Mubarak to keep his power. He is making the Egyptians fight the Egyptians. Civil war. So we are not fighting a foreign invasion. We are. He wants his men to kill the revolution. Madam Nawal. Yeah. The sword of Ali for Sawra. The sword of Ali for Sawra. Madam Nawal. Yeah. So, so you see what his plan. His plan is that his men, they gave him, they gave each man 50 pounds and a chicken. For each man, they gave him bread to kill us and beat us here. And the horses, you saw the horses and the camels. So I am here because I am part of Egypt. I was oppressed by Sadat and Mubarak. As a writer, as a doctor, I was silenced in the media. My were, books were censored. You were also a, a government minister at one point. Weren't you like minister of education or something? No, I was the director general of health education during the 50s and 60s, during the 60s. I am a doctor and I am a writer. My books are everywhere in Arabic and in other. But I am here because I feel I am born again. I am 80 years of age, 80. Eight zero. So I am born again. Those millions speak for me and I speak for them. And now we, our power is here. We stay here. Tonight I sleep here. Tonight. Oh. Yes, tonight I sleep. The first night I sleep here. Because and we should be together. Yesterday Mubarak sent thugs into Tafrir Square to fight people, to try to frighten people. Yes. Does that, but, and people are a little bit scared, I think. Uh, no, 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 few people, few people were scared. So but are people then, more angry or are they more scared? No, they are more angry. No, this is anger. Fear did not work because Mubarak used fear to divide us. So nobody, do you see anybody is afraid now? Nobody. I am. <laughs> nobody is afraid. If you go around, no, I am not afraid. I am 80 and I am not afraid. Look at the young people. Those people are oppressed since many years. And now it's the, this is a unique, I have seen Egyptian revolutions since King Farouk. Since King Farouk during the 40s and the 50s. And since Nasser, we demonstrated against Nasser. We demonstrated against Sadat. He put us in prison. We came out. Mubarak gave promises. He never, he never fulfilled his promise. Now, now he's giving promises. Nobody believed him. Nobody believed him. So he, he now he is, there is no Mubarak now. We are the post-Mubarak period, post-Mubarak area. But he should not go like Ben Ali. He should stay and be on trial. He should not go. He should be on trial to see the corruption, the money, the money that we were robbed of our money. So he should be on trial. I hope that the universal media be with us. We need your moral support. And what about the United States? What would you like President Obama to do? Well, Obama cannot do anything. Because Obama can give orders to Mubarak. But he cannot do anything for the people. Mubarak will never do anything. I wrote an article against his article, against his speech in Cairo. Because he said, I will do, I will do, he never. Obama never fulfilled his promises, never. And we are not going to be American colony, no. We are liberated because we are liberated from American colonialism. Sadat brought us American colonialism here. And we, we Mubarak, uh, Obama cannot give us orders. The people here decide. The people here decide. And Obama should listen to us. Obama should listen. We don't listen to him. We don't listen to Obama. Obama listened to us. 
and you are one of the Arab world's most famous yeah. women advocates. Yeah. Uh, now, it is striking that there are many women here in Tahrir who are also pushing for more democracy. Do you think that is a change? Do you think women are coming out of more out of the margins of society to demand their case? Most of the women here never came out of their houses. Some of them are veiled, some with the niqab. They came out. They, some of them never left their house and they came out. And now we don't say men and women or Christian. What happened now? We say Egypt. We said Egypt, we need a constitution that makes us equal. No separation between men and women. No distinction between Christians and Muslims. We are Egypt and there must be equality. We came out for freedom, dignity, equality and justice. We came out for that. And we are asking also that we should have um, equality between men and, and women in the family code. Also, the family code, men and women should be equal. The, in the constitution, men and women equal. The constitution should be secular. Mm. Secular. We are not government. Uh, we are not going to have a, a religious state. We need a secular state. And, and Ms. Sadawi, is there a danger, in fact, that actually there would be a people's revolution, Mubarak would be overthrown, but that the Muslim Brotherhood no. would take power no. and that no. women would be uh, worse if, off? No. If you go around, the Muslim Brotherhood are part of the people. They are part. They are part, and they know. They know they are. They are not. The, they are not the majority. All the parties are, uh, are minority. The political parties are minority. But the majority of people, you know, the, this revolution was made by people who have no any political party. It's a spontaneous, it's a very spontaneous revolution, not related to uh, the left or the right or the Muslim brothers or anybody. If you see, they are ordinary people. Ordinary young students, women and men who never know politics. So this is a real revolution, not organized by any party. Because those parties were, were created by Sadat. Sadat created the political party. Uh, well, thank you so much. I'm just going to take a uh, photo of you because I'm and such you a great. Live in New York. I live in New York. And uh, what's your name? It's, I it's, give me your card. Yeah, it's, I'll write it for you. Uh, it's, and uh, give me your telephone. Okay. It's Nicholas Kristoff. Uh, and your and, telephone in New York. Okay. Which one? Uh, Chicago, New York Times. Times. New York Times. Yeah, yes. it's in, in the newspaper. This is for the website. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank what happened to your hand? Were you punching somebody? <laughs> Were you punching somebody with the hand? <laughs> your hand. You hurt your uh, hand. <laughs> not here. Not here. <laughs> Nobody hey. can touch me. <laughs> Let me just take a quick photo first. Okay, one, two, three. Very good. Thank you so much. Thank you.